More and more people are adopting dogs from shelters and rescues, and today one very special dog went home to a very special owner. Cody is a rare intersex dog, and an attorney who made headlines in the fight for same-sex marriage is one of Cody's new moms. Action News reporter Kimberly Craig is live outside the vet where Cody was officially adopted. How special, Kim? It really is a special story, Glenn. And Dr. Michael Hood says he's never seen an intersex dog in his 23 years of practicing. Now, he has classified Cody as male, but no doubt Cody is very special. When we met Cody, it was that was it. That was my dog. Cody is the unique intersex dog that needed a home where he could get the love every dog yearns for. And today was his big day. Attorney Dana Nessel, who was on the front lines in the fight for same sex marriage, and her wife, Alana McGuire, are adopting this very special pup. I just think that, you know, we're all God's creatures, right? And you don't treat um, one person or, or a dog or anyone at all any differently mm -hmm. based on those kind of unique qualities and the things that we love about this particular dog have nothing to do with um, whether it's a boy or whether it's a girl. I certainly don't think that the dog will identify with one particular gender <laughs> over another. I think the dog just wants to be loved and we Absolutely. intend yeah. to provide him with a lot of that. And the couple says their 12-year-old boys can't wait to have a dog. They already have two cats, and yes, they've all met during a home visit by Detroit Dog Rescue. DDR picked up Cody after getting a call from Detroit Animal Care and Control. He had a respiratory infection, wasn't doing so good, so they asked us to take him, and we took him into our care and found, in fact, that he did have a respiratory infection. He also was suffering from heartworm, and he also had both sex organs, so quite a unique case. If you ran him by 100 people, they'd say, oh, I think that's a girl dog, I think it's a girl dog. Um, but in fact, it really is a male dog and he only has testicles and um, so that's uh, that's his story. And Cody sure seems happy to finally be going to a home of his very own and after the heartworm treatment is complete he'll be neutered. You take down the risk of cancer you take you know dogs that escape their yard usually they're not spayed or neutered they're in heat and wanting to get out of the yard so you eliminate so many more problems than just puppies when you spay or neuter. He's had from all accounts a really tough life <laughs> and I think that Dana and I can probably provide him with something that's hopefully a lot better. Cody definitely now in a good home and big thanks to Detroit Dog Rescue for all they do for sick, abused and neglected dogs in our area. And Cody's new family, I'm told, is still trying to come up with a name for Cody, a new name for his new life. And I'm told Ziggy Stardust is at the top of the list. <laughs> Reporting live in Southfield, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News, back to you. Love it, Kim. Love is all they need. Thank you so much.